stand up on soapboxes just to defend the First Amendment. What the Wobblies were doing downtown San Diego in 1912 was standing up and giving speeches like this. Fellow workers and friends, how come Sprinkles has got everything and you've got nothing? It's time to get smart and join the one big union. So fundamentally, what this is about is a celebration of union people struggling for civil rights, First Amendment rights, and public assembly rights that are relevant to anybody who values those things in this city and in the United States of America. And also centrally important to what the IWW were doing in 1912 is that theme of economic inequality. When the Wobblies stood up and said, how come Spreckles has got everything and you got nothing? They knew that we were a city that was run by a narrow plutocracy, the rule of the dollar, where those who had the money to buy power did. Those who had the money to buy the city's newspaper did. Sound familiar? Yeah. So I'm here today to say if this anniversary means anything, we should not just pass a resolution to the city council, which is fantastic. We need to defend free speech in the streets now. And more importantly than that, we need to defend workers' rights to collective bargaining and to have a political voice in this country or it's going to go away. And just as, and just as the Wobblies stood in the streets and spoke to the going photography, anybody who reads the newspaper, and this is largely the result of the work of Occupy, knows that we're back to the future. That we have a gap between the rich and the